but yeah not too shabby an effort on a cold night um this is where this is definitely definitely not me being motivated um this is discipline Wednesday, it's time for the nine mile trail, the nine mile loop, the staple Wednesday workout that's been happening on a hump day, um, humps for hump day. Uh, it's very cold today, as you can see, it's snowed a little bit overnight. The weather, man, it's just it's either raining or it's snowing or it's gales. Um, but yeah, this is really nice. Look, get to play in the woods today, uh, starting the trail. I'm doing the reverse loop so I like to alternate which way around I do it but I'm going to do the reverse loop because I did it the other way around for my long run on Sunday the GoPro's already not working doesn't like the cold um and yeah I've got to start with the big big hill which way is it is that there big climb now uh to start this run which is uh wonderful as I have got really bad doms from yesterday in the gym I went a little bit too enthusiastic but yeah but I'm on it There we go, nine miles done. God, that was a shuffle. Doms did not ease up. Definitely went too hard in the gym yesterday, a bit keen. Um, the bonus though, is that my heart rate was nice and low. It was also very slippy. I thought this snow was just nice powdering. It was actually quite slippy. I've been using the Innovate Ultra, uh, let me see if I can get this, Ultra G Trail Fly, I think. Um, something like that, I'll put the right name on the screen, but they're good. Um, super comfy. Um, I find them good kind of when my feet are a bit battered from training because I've got a wider toe box. Um, so when your feet do get tired. Grip wise, mm, not the best. Um, but they are a comfy shoe. Good for fire track, like that. Definitely. Anyway, better go and take over. Huh. Wow. That was interesting. It's so cold that I feel like it's making my breathing difficult. But that was uh, 12 minutes warm up because I wanted to cross the uh, railway crossing. 12 minutes threshold into five by two minutes hard. Sorry, this is really rubbish, isn't it? You can't see my face. Um, and then 12 minutes threshold. Push it a little bit at the end of that threshold, which is why I'm so out of breath. Um, but yeah, not too shabby an effort on a cold night. Um, this is where, this is definitely, definitely not me being motivated. Um, this is discipline and actually saying to the kids that I was going to go out and uh, sticking to what I said I was going to do but yeah now just going back to rescue my gilet body warmer depending on where you're from um, yeah and do my cool down warm down is it cool down or warm down because I always say cool down you're cooling the body down but I know a lot of you say warm down anyway digress Ha! Ah, there's they done. It's so clear. I don't know if you can see the stars. Probably not. Right, where's the chalet? Let's go find it. Look at that. It's so cold that the body warmer has started glistening. 
<laughs> Are we going today, Bear? Bear, 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 Bear. You've got your hand warmers, haven't you? Tell me. Yeah, good hand warmers. So Alice and I are off to Park Run. It's Lizzie's 300th park run today and she's gonna have a go at a big one. So we're gonna walk, we're gonna run and we're gonna have lots of fun. fun. <laughs> um, it's very cold this morning. We're in the minus temperatures, but yeah, we've got hand warmers, we've got layers and Alice is excited to see um, the lake frozen. Can do you? Yeah. Come here with your token. Token to get scanned. Fantastic. And then. Did you do the whole park run? Did you do your first 5K? Were you super good? Yeah. Are you tired now? Yeah. I'm taking it to Greg to get a sausage roll and a hot chocolate. Yeah. Run <laughs> number two of the day done. That's seven miles. Um, with one mile warm up and then six strong yeah i feel like that was the right kind of effort felt nice wasn't completely gassed um and quite nice after doing three three miles of alice this morning um what a good saturday alice absolutely loves park run i've gone out and done my second run the run on plan it felt good pace was nice effort for the effort and yeah Good day. Uh, I'm going to carry on doing the fun family kids stuff. Uh, Harry's got a bit of a thing for play at the moment, so yeah, I'm finding it everywhere. And we're making lots of bunnies and stars and pancakes and toast, uh, which he got stuck in Alice's toaster for her kitchen, so she wasn't impressed. All fun and games. Okay, so I'm finally out for my long run. Um, today, I have spent the day, oh, I hate myself for this. Well, I spent the morning taking my 11 year old to try and find a certain drink that's out of stock everywhere. Yep, we went prime hunting. Uh, oh, he's been on about this drink, you know, because people of his age are since before Christmas so I finally caved today and thought we're going to try and find it anyway we didn't find the drink we had a little adventure if you can call it that and uh, here I am out doing my long run after driving for hours uh, but it's 16 hilly miles today trail miles just enjoying switching back off after going around supermarkets trying to find bread. Yeah, so today's easy. Um, long ones are all easy, 
trail pretty much at the moment just building up time on feet um, and yeah enjoying it River a quarter of the way in. It's very slow today, but that's all right. Time on feet. It's looking really horrible actually. Um, there seems to be a lovely bend. Not now. So I had to have a bit of a scrubbing around for fuel for Giles. Um, last week on my long run, I tried science and sport and um, the beta fuel. It didn't sit great. Um, I tried the apple and I'm not sure if that makes a difference, but my stomach just cramped the whole run after taking it. And that was taking little bits at a time. So anyway, this week, because I still haven't placed an order for gels, um, time keeps ticking, ticking by. But yeah, this week, I've dug out some Vela Fort or Vela Forte. Maybe Vela Forte. Sounds a bit more fun, actually. Um, so yeah, I've got a few of these to try. First one being a ribba, which I presume is that Ribena, real fruit and electrolytes. So, yeah, we'll try that. Currently got a Haribo in my mouth too, because you know, Haribo is a life for me on these runs. There we go, eight miles. This is the out point, the peak, the peak of the hill. Oh. There we go, run done. Uh, sorry, I got um, Stephen Marcus in my ears talking about um, strength training actually and different types and application to running volume but yeah that's um 18 15.7 miles done and i'm good with that that's fine that's cool now i just want to go home and sit down i've decompressed after the prime experience huh, i made it in time for sunset i've got time to spare there we go that's the fourth week of marathon training Done. Made it. That's it. I've got you now. Why have you got your bag packed? He's going on holiday. Where are you I'm going to go on holiday. Where are you going on holiday? Hmm. Gaps. Huh? Why did you take your? Oh, you can pay Jay back.